Hey guys, what's up? It's your girls, Twin Goddesses, and I'm Alicia, and I am back with another video featuring AshyMaryHair.com. So if you guys are interested in this wig, definitely check the description box down below where everything is going to be linked for you. Ashy Mary decided to send me another unit, but y'all, can we please give a round of applause for these gifts? So if you place an order for a wig, you're definitely going to be getting a slip and a whole bunch of other goodies, but this is the unit that I did pick up from them. This is their Invisi Strap Snug Fit. 360 lace front wig so you guys can see this is how it comes it features that pre-cut lace as well as that 13 by 6 inches of transparent lace and those knots do come pre-bleached but the star of the show is ashy mary's clear invisi strap with their crystal adjustable pulley and you guys can see how that looks and there's the pulley there once you pull on that cord the nape is going to pretty much lay extremely flat without any clues making it the most beginner friendly unit that they offer and this unit also includes their silicone non-slip elastic band for extra security so this is the way my unit came directly out of the box i'm going to be doing some really quick styling this unit is pre-plucked and ready to wear but i'm going to spray some water throughout the unit and then apply a bit of my gel along the edges of the front and the back I know for some of you, you might be thinking, well, do I have to do this with my unit? You absolutely don't, but this is a quick hack that I kind of learned when it comes down to 360s. I don't really like to fight with the unit or, you know, try to get the hair to go up, but it doesn't want to. But I find if I prep the unit with some gel along the nape and the edges, the unit will be ready to wear and you really don't have to do much to get the unit to go up in a high bun or a high ponytail now this unit does come in a water wave texture what i'm going to do here is restyle those waves by just using some water and a detangling brush and i love to use this pop lock by the dew it is like a jelly consistency and it really helps with enhancing those waves or curls i even like this on my natural hair i gotta do a tutorial for you guys because i think this is a game changer that no one is talking about but I'm gonna go ahead and continue on with getting those waves to pop by using some water my detangling brush and that pop lock gel Yeah, I gotta fall back We getting out 
Okay, so that is how the curls came out after I allowed the hair to dry overnight. You definitely want to kind of crunch the hair because it will have a cast. But what I'm going to do now is go ahead and get the unit on. Now you guys can see how that lace is looking since it is pre-cut. I will say that this unit does fit big head friendly. So because of that, I am going to adhere my unit down even though this is a glueless. So I'm just gonna take my got to be blast free spray and spray a bit of it along my forehead, then blow dry it down. And I like to go ahead and do that again, just so I have a nice secure hold. And I'm just going to apply the unit on top of that. Because of the fact that I have more of a rounder forehead and I feel like the hairline on this unit is a bit square. I am just going to create some baby hairs. It is 100% up to you. So I went ahead and separated a few hairs in the front and then applied an elastic strap. After about 15 minutes or so, I then removed the elastic strap and I feel like the edges are nice and secure. I'm going to cut down those baby hairs and then use some mousse and just do what I do. <laughs> Yeah, I do not know, but this I am sure It ain't gonna be the same no more Now this lace is transparent, but I do feel like it does blend in with the skin pretty well, but I'm just gonna add a bit of foundation just for added security, I guess. And I like to also add a little bit of concealer in that parting space just to define it. Now my curls did kind of get a little bit frizzy because I was manipulating the hair a lot. So I'm just going to apply some more water to the hair and you can see those waves do pop back and as far as the baby hairs they're not my best but i just wanted something very subtle and you can see that 13 by 6 inches of parting space you can part this hair ear to ear six inches back which i absolutely love so this unit is extremely versatile but y'all i'm gonna show you guys the back of the unit like let's see what this 360 does so i'm just gonna go ahead and i put the hair up in a bun and now i'm just going to adjust the backing so you take this little adjustable pulley thingy and you just pull on it there's like a little hook that you pull and it tightens the back I didn't have to glue the back down at all and you just tuck in those little straps and you're good and ready to wear you don't have to put no glue back there <laughs> which I love and this unit is beginner friendly but I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the angles of the hair if I haven't mentioned before um, this unit is 24 inches long 180 percent density and the texture is a water wave I am five foot eight and that's where the hair falls on me but what I'm going to do now now is show you guys a few quick styles and how you can wear this unit if you do plan on getting it. Let me know how you plan on wearing yours. Again, y'all, this is Ashy Mary Hairs and Vizzy Strap 360 Lace Wig. Let me know what you guys think of it, and I'll catch you in the next video. Bye, guys. Mm -hmm.